with another watch me work video so in this video i will be using bofox hair to achieve the look that i am going for so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to tone the hair using shimmer light shampoo so it's easy as just putting some um shampoo and some water and dipping the wig in some water because y'all know that 613 hair has that tinge of yellow in it and if you want that like grayish kind of like cold blue look you do not want any yellow in your hair to start out with so i'm finished dipping the hair in the um shampoo water and now my hair is looking more gray and it's looking more ashy so i'm gonna pour that water out and i'm gonna pour some new water in and for my color i'm using um adore titanium and adore Lux blue so i put the adore titanium in the water first and then after that i take some of the luxe blue and i pour it in as well after that so i'm doing the same thing that i did in the beginning dip dyeing is honestly kind of self-explanatory but you have to um like there's something you can do <laughs> you can take a paddle brush because if you don't get the color to disperse well enough then it's going to look patchy i actually learned that from slay by jordan so you can see that i'm using the paddle brush to get the color to um be even because if it's not even it's gonna it's not gonna look good and then you're gonna have to do it again so using a paddle brush is very very helpful so this was my first go round of using the uh the dye so now you can obviously see that i have some blonde patches in the middle so i'm gonna put some more titanium and some more lux blue in there and i'm kind of opening up the wig and i'm dipping it in the water because i was like i'm not about to do this twice <laughs> so i'm opening up the wig and i'm putting kind of like the middle backside into the water as you can see right here i was low-key kind of fighting with that hair because one i was using one bundle from a different company and it was it took a while for that hair to take the color but it eventually took Here is what my color looks like when it's wet. So um, I'm going to put a picture up of my inspo that I got from it. So <laughs> I think my gray was a little bit too light, but I still like that cloudy day. Um, like it's like a gloomy day blue. You know how when you go outside and it's not quite cloudy, but it's not quite sunny outside. It's kind of like that dreary blue um outside color i don't know but i am absolutely in love with this blue y'all i'm really kind of trying to i'm kind of i'm trying to step outside the box when it comes to my color and i don't do a lot of things that are on the opposite side of the spectrum meaning like blues and grays and stuff so this is really cute so um i'm flat ironing the hair and this hair it doesn't shed at all like i'm i'm not lying to y'all this hair does not shed i'm i got some strings when i washed it as as does any hair but when i was brushing it i didn't get any shedding at all this is not sponsored so go get y'all some bow fox hair i'm gonna drop the link down in the description box for y'all and uh so y'all can get this hair so now i'm gonna spice it up a little bit because i'm going to sell this wig this wig is actually for sale right now and i'm gonna curl it and at first i was gonna do some pink curls but i changed my mind <laughs> but in this clip you're gonna see me doing some pink curls and also y'all do not talk about how i curl this hair um <laughs> i'm not a beautician but the way i curl hair gets the job done so here is what my curls look like um i use the one and one fourth barrel to achieve this look i really really love this color like i am obsessed if i wasn't selling this i would wear it myself
So now I'm finished um, curling the wig, brushing out the curls, all that good stuff. So now I'm taking my hot comb and I'm doing like that fancy closure style. I don't know what to call it, but they do it on Instagram. So I'm going to do it too so my wig can look good. So now I'm taking my hot comb and I'm putting it on top of the wig so I can make it flat again. Because sometimes when you curl wigs, they get a little fluffy in the top and I want to make that flat again so you've come to the end of this video make sure you like comment and subscribe to my channel all my social media will be down in the description box as well as videos that I have uploaded in the past so if you want to purchase this wig um you can contact me or you can purchase it from my Etsy shop so with that being said I'll see y'all in my next video